How can you get your child off to a really good start in the morning? Hi, I'm Betty White with Answers for Parents. Teachers tell us a lot of times that the way they do at school depends on the kind of morning they've had at home. So we're going to take a look at some of the things that parents say work for them. Hopefully, they'll work for you too. First of all, the key word is organization, and it starts not the morning of, but the night before. Before your child goes to bed, all books, homework, assignments need to be gathered up and placed on a desk or a certain place. And then decision about whether to buy lunch or not needs to be made, and if buying lunch, money should be placed with the books. Clothes need to be laid out, the alarm clock set. Now to the morning of. Well, there doesn't really seem to be a right or wrong pattern of breakfast first and then dressed or dressed and then breakfast, but many families do follow the getting dressed by a certain time and all having breakfast together. Studies do show that the children who eat breakfast are more alert and do better than those that don't. Now this may take some deviating from the standard breakfast menu of bacon, eggs, toast, biscuits, and whatever that you usually come up with to get your child to eat, something other than junk food that is. But hopefully the family can have time together, keep the conversation pleasant, avoid the arguments, and get off to a good start. And while this takes a lot of effort on everyone's part, teachers tell us that it's well worth it. If you have questions on this topic or others, write to me, Betty White, in the care of Channel C.